Podcasts on unctv.org are made possible through the financial contributions of viewers like you, who invite you to join them in supporting UNCTV. If you're looking for a perfect recipe for a weekend getaway, add a lovely old home, a touch of mystery, and a delicious home-cooked breakfast. As Elizabeth Wilder discovered, you'll end up with one relaxing trip to the Ashford Inn in Clinton. All the ingredients are here. Comfortable bedrooms, the smell of bacon in the morning. That's what makes the house smell good along with the coffee. And the intriguing story of a Civil War colonel named John Ashford who made this his home in 1869. Yes, this is the Confederate States of America a declaration making Colonel Ashford a colonel. It's initialed on the bottom by Robert E. Lee and it is signed by General Scales, Brigadier General Scales. With the Colonel, wife Elizabeth, and Uncle Billy looking on, the old home place is now a bed and breakfast. And it's not a destination. You know, you're, you're not going to say, oh, I've always wanted to go to Clinton. Um, but you may stumble upon it and be pleasantly surprised. The innkeepers were thrilled to find the Ashford and relocate from New Jersey. Now they're happy to show off their lovely B&B. These little pocket doors. If you open up the doors and you swing open the window, it'll create a cross ventilation, just like a transom on top of a door lets the heat out. This lets the cool air flow through the house. It's kind of like air, early air conditioning. About an hour between Raleigh and Wilmington, the inn attracts guests looking for a getaway and business travelers wanting something different, like a hammock in the backyard. I highly recommend it if uh, you're visiting in Clinton or you're here in business or you need to stay here in Ashford then. <laughs> Dr. Marcus stays here five or six times a uh, month to be close to the hospital <laughs> when he's on call. It's a very special place, uh, has history. Uh, when you come here, you feel you're coming to home. You know, we love when people love the house. Like, we love this house. We think it's beautiful and it feels good. And um, when people feel that too, that, that we like that. It's the little things that keep customers coming back, like Patty's garlic-coated pretzels and the bar affectionately known as the boardroom where friends gather and couples reconnect. No occasion. Our occasion is to get away, yeah. you know, really just for some time for right. ourselves. You know, it's not an anniversary or anything. Every now and then. For Grace Ho and husband Ken Yang, it's a break from the kids and a chance to be pampered and enjoy a deep soaking tub. When we have friends come by, this is where we try to have them stay. Each of the five rooms has its own thermostat, television, and high-speed internet access as standard features. But there are a few things you won't find anywhere else. But one of the most unique things about the Ashford Inn is a strange phenomenon that happens every night just after dark. Notice the distinct dark arrow at the bottom of your screen. Some speculate it appears to point to an old crime scene. Others suggest it's some kind of optical illusion. But perhaps it's just an unusual welcome sign suggesting you come and stay a night or two. Oh, I wasn't expecting you to be there. Another special feature at the Ashford is that you can eat your homemade breakfast whenever you want to. It's an important perk for travelers who can't wait around for a group breakfast. Last night we went out and when people found out where we were staying, they said, you're going to love the food. Patty's a great cook. And she doesn't disappoint. Today, Patty prepares Texas French toast, bacon, fresh fruit parfait with yogurt drizzled on top, and a cheese danish. After breakfast, explore downtown visit the local museum, or take in an art exhibit at the Arts Council a few doors down from the Ashford. We would like people to rediscover the area and just come and just check it out because it's a really nice, quiet, small town, really nice people, very friendly people. Um, it's just what we like about it. 
The Ashford Inn is at 615 College Street in Clinton. For information about rates and reservations, give them a call at 888-288-4346 or check them out online at ashford-inn.com. And if you can't make the trip just yet, log on to our website for the Ashford Inn's fantastic French toast recipe. Podcasts on unctv.org are made possible through the financial contributions of viewers like you, who invite you to join them in supporting UNCTV.